Hello, I'm Charlie and welcome to Authentic Mental Health, the channel that offers advice and friendly support within our like-minded community. If you're struggling with your mental health, please subscribe to this channel to join a community of like-minded people. In today's video, should you take Xanax for anxiety, we are going to be taking a look at the pros and the cons of taking Xanax for anxiety. Alprazolam, also known as Xanax, belongs to a group of medications called benzodiazepines. Benzodiazepines act on the brain and central nervous system to produce a calming effect. People use and take Xanax to help them with anxiety and panic disorder. Xanax is the number one prescribed psychiatric medication in the United States. If you're prescribed Xanax for your anxiety or panic disorder, you may feel, quote, normal, unquote, after taking your first dose. You may also feel relaxed, tired, or quiet, depending on the dose you have been prescribed. Xanax is prescribed in doses that are available in milligrams. Depending on the symptoms you experience of your anxiety or panic disorder, you may be prescribed a high dose, or a low dose. The dosages that are available for Xanax are 0.25 milligrams, 0.5 milligrams, 1 milligram, and 2 milligrams. The effects of Xanax become more significant the higher the milligram you take. Doctors always recommend that first time Xanax users start with the lowest possible dose until you know exactly how it will affect you. Higher doses can be fatal and you should never take more than what your doctor has prescribed. The effects of taking Xanax should be mild, but detectable. If you experience any of the following symptoms, you should seek medical attention immediately. Extreme drowsiness, muscle weakness, confusion, fainting, loss of balance, and feeling lightheaded. Xanax is taken orally, and is quickly absorbed into your bloodstream. Some people experience the effects of Xanax within five to 10 minutes of taking it. And everyone should start to feel the effects of Xanax within the hour. This is why Xanax is so popular for people struggling with anxiety and panic attacks. During a panic attack or an anxiety attack, you can take a Xanax and within a few minutes, you should start to see the symptoms of your anxiety attack or panic attack start to slowly fade away. The effects of Xanax are brief. Most people feel the strongest impact within two to four hours after taking it. However, you may feel a fuzzy feeling for several hours after that. It is also possible to build up a tolerance to Xanax. If that happens, you may notice it takes longer for you to feel the effects of it, and the effects may wear off more quickly. Xanax has a half-life of about 11 hours, which means by that time, your body will eliminate half of the dose you have taken. So should you take Xanax for anxiety? As you've heard and seen in this video, Xanax is extremely beneficial in removing the symptoms of anxiety and panic attacks, such as a racing heart, feeling out of control, and restlessness. If you think Xanax could help you with your anxiety or panic attacks, please see a doctor and get a prescription. Never self-medicate with Xanax or take it recreationally. I now want to hear from you guys and girls in the comment section down below. Are you currently prescribed Xanax or have you ever been prescribed Xanax before? Does it help you with your anxiety or panic attacks? Please let me and others know in the comment section down below. If you're struggling with your anxiety and you need help, there is a link in the description box down below where you can speak to a mental health professional immediately and get the help you need and deserve to get your life back on track and to help you with your anxiety. The link is in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching guys and girls. Take care and I'll see you all again in another video.